what you are, Ralph, is a vital cog in the defense mechanism of this country. Great. Invisible cog. I know it's rough, kid, but I'm gonna be right there with you all the way. Yeah? How will you know? Uh, you'll tell me. <laughs> you have absolutely no conception of what it's like, Bill. I feel like Claude Rains in the old movie The Invisible Man. He used to go around wrapped in bandages so nobody would know he wasn't there. It drove him crazy. We also got some advantages here. Well, it's driving me crazy, too. Yeah, yeah we can really use this thing. Use it? That gun sight is vital to the defense of your country, Ralph. Now, quit crying and think. The guys that stole it have no loyalty to the U.S. of A. or anybody else. They're gonna sell it to whoever pays them the biggest bucks. How can you even think about that when I'm sitting here with air blowing through me, huh? That gun sight is one of the most devastating weapons ever devised, Ralph. You want the Ruskies to get it? Okay. Outside. Yeah, sure. Some ID? <laughs> yeah. Very nice. FBI. Nice. Very nice. Looks like the real thing. That's because it is. You got a badge for your friend Harvey in the car? You see uh, somebody else in my car, officer? No. Don't you? Certainly not. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I get it. You saw me talking to myself. You thought I was uh, checking down at the funny farm, right? Well, I, I saw you talking to yourself. Nah, I'm rehearsing. I gotta give a speech at Whitney High for government day. Don't tell me you never got nailed on one of these volunteer numbers. That's traffic thing. Oh, well, I don't know. I guess it's not so bad. I, we all have to do our bit. So, anyway, I'm running a little late, so uh, uh, it's nice to talk to you, Officer Spire. See you again.